Hi Cancer, Sun and Rising and Venus and welcome to your love reading for November 2022. I'll be taking a look at your energies, your love interests and the possible outcome for November. Let's go ahead and get started. Please keep in mind that this will not resonate with all of you. So you're more than welcome to check your other placements. All right, Cancer. God, angels, Holy Spirit, what's going on with Cancer at this time? November 2022 when it comes to love. God, angels, Holy Spirit, can you one more. Two of Wands, the Justice, and the Three of Pentacles in reverse. Under the deck, you have the Queen of Swords in reverse. All right, strong Libra here. Gemini, Aquarius, maybe an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Capricorn for some of you. So, Cancer, okay, right now I feel like you're deciding to move towards a specific direction here. Some of you could have had an option between two to three people and I see you moving towards a specific person or a specific direction. Some of you may be very interested in traveling at this time or exploring something new. I feel like right now you are feeling on top of the world, you're feeling like, you know what, I can make the decision that I want to make. I feel like karma is on your side at this time. Good karma. Right now, some of you, you are speaking your truth. All right. I feel like right now you are very clear on what direction, what, what direction it is you want to go. Now, I do feel like something here wasn't working out for you, Cancer, maybe with a specific person. Picking up on air and earth energy. You know, I feel like maybe something was just not working out here between you and a specific person. Someone here could have been very harsh with their words. All right, so this person could have a sharp tongue, especially if they're Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They say things without really thinking. Maybe this person's always wanting proof, like show me proof um, where you were, what you were doing, who you're talking to, etc. Maybe you two just can't or couldn't see eye to eye. So I feel like things were just not working out here. Yeah, I mean, with the Three of Pentacles in reverse, like you, you couldn't work well together. You couldn't see eye to eye. You just things always ended up chaotic between you two. I see you determined to move towards a specific person or a specific direction here. Tell me about this person on Cancer's mind. God, Angels, Holy Spirit, give me clear messages. For very few of you, you could have been dealing with someone at a distance, or you are dealing with someone at a distance. Current energies for Cancer. Tell me about this person's energies for Cancer, please. Tell me about this person's energies for the sign of Cancer. Two of Cups, Hermit in Reverse, and the Two of Pentacles in Reverse. Strong Virgo energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Right now, whoever it is that you're thinking about Cancer, they're very, very attracted to you. I will throw that out there. This could be a friendship or maybe start off as friends, all right? But I see a strong spiritual connection here. This could be a soulmate. Right now, your person is feeling lonely. Um, this person could be ignoring wise advice, okay? This could be someone who doesn't listen to stubborn energy. Let's put it that way. This person could be very stubborn. Um, they don't want to listen to good advice. They ignore good advice. So right now, I feel like your person is feeling very lonely, very isolated. This person could be juggling, all right? I will throw that out there for very few of you. This person could be struggling financially or they could be dealing with you and someone else. But I feel like they're tired of that. They're tired of juggling either too many responsibilities or they're tired of juggling you and someone else. I feel like this person has strong feelings for you, but they might be in a situation where they're unhappy or they're feeling lonely. See, so tell me more. This person's energy is for cancer. wants to show its face yeah ace of swords all right i feel like this person is very clear that they have strong feelings for you they're aware that they want to be with you um if this person hasn't already cancer they will be confessing their attraction for you their love for you all right 
tell me more. I feel like they it's going to catch you off guard. One more. This person that Cancer is thinking about, dealing with, connecting with at this time. Four of Cups. Yeah, I feel like right now this person's evaluating a lot of things, okay? And I feel like after a moment of thinking, contemplating, reflecting, they will come through to speak some truth to you. Or at least they're wanting to speak a truth to you here. They might be fearing that you'll reject them, all right? Strong Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here, Libra. Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo. See, so tell me more. Tell me, what is the possible outcome for cancer and this person on their mind? What is the possible outcome for cancer and this person on their mind, please? What is the possible outcome? Okay. okay. So, Eight of Cups in reverse, the Nine of Swords in reverse, the Two of Swords, and the Ace of Wands under the deck. Yeah, this person's very attracted to you, Cancer. They fantasize about you. They want this new beginning with you. They've tried to let you go. They've tried to walk away from you. And I feel like I feel like both of you can't leave each other alone. I don't know why I'm feeling that energy, but I feel like someone here in the near future, at least the outcome, I don't see a complete ending, to be quite honest. I feel like the pressure will be released. The anxiety will be released. Um the stress, okay, maybe you or this person has been losing sleep over this, but I feel like that's going to be ending here in November. Now, I do feel like there's still a decision that needs to be made, either on your end or their end, maybe between two people, or whether or not to move this forward, okay? So, I do feel like there could be a new beginning here between you two or a new start. Let's go ahead and dig further. Tell me more about the possible outcome. For cancer and the person on their mind, that angels, Holy Spirit. Tell me more. Possible outcome for cancer and the person on their mind. November 2022. Eight of Wands. A lot of communication, a lot of flirting energy, a lot of good news coming here. Yeah, this is not over. With the death card in reverse here, I feel like this is not over. All right, this could be a situation where someone could have been stuck at a crossroads either between of whether or not to move this forward or between two people. I feel like there's a new beginning here between you two, a lot of back and forth communication, a lot of phone calls, text messages, possible good news, attraction, flirting energy. And yeah, I feel like this could learn to long-term stability here between you two, 10 of pentacles. You two could work very well together. All right, that's what I'm seeing. So I feel like both of you can't let each other go. Both of you can't release each other here. There's a lot of attraction here, a lot of love. And I feel like there is a possibly a new beginning between you two. Or, yeah, I can't make this up. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Hierophon, Ace of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Taurus, Cancer Energy, Capricorn, Virgo, Scorpio, Libra, Pisces. Could be any sign though. So... Yeah, for some of you, you guys could be deciding to move in together, get married, have a new beginning, start a relationship, all right? So just keep that in mind. So not bad, not bad, Cancer. All right, let's go ahead and see what this person wants to tell you. What's the hidden truth here? If I need just Holy Spirit, give me clear messages. What is the hidden truth? What does this person want to tell Cancer? I bury myself in work to forget you. I want to be more than friends. Okay, I sh wish I can share my good news with you. Yeah, so for some of you, this person will be sharing some good news with you here. For some of you, once again, maybe they're not available. They're trying maybe to get out of this relationship or another connection that they're in, or it could be vice versa. Maybe you are cancer. But this person wants to be more than friends. They want to share some good news with you. They could work a lot to not think about you. What does this person want to tell cancer, please? I love you unconditionally. Yeah, this person's in love with you, Cancer. Yep. And I want to feel that way again. And under the deck, I want you. Yeah, I can't make this up, Cancer. This is someone who has a lot of attraction and love for you. All right, I feel like this is not over. Could have been a very, you know, someone could have been stuck at a crossroads again about whether or not to move things forward or 
between two people and I see them wanting to come forward here and have a new beginning with you. This was your love reading for November 2022. If it did not resonate, feel free to check the other placements. Thank you to all my loyal subscribers who continue to love and support my channel. And if you haven't already, please like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.